Roke enters the Pantheon Arena this week with Roke Indomitable at a minus 15 power level. This is going to be a little bit harder than last week, so make sure you get a good fire team, get out there, and have some fun. I have that and all the rest of the reset information that you need for this week coming up right now. In Crucible this week, the new maps playlist is still going to be there, but we also get Sparrow Control and Rift. Whatever you do, make sure you get a good fire team, get out there and make Shaxx proud. The Exotic Mission Zero Hour returns this week. You can get your Outbreak Perfected Craftable if you finish this on Normal or Legend difficulty and beat the time. You can also get started on getting those secret chests and unlocking your exotic ship. Also, the other Exotic Mission this week is going to be Operation Seraph Shield. This is where you can get your Craftable Revision Zero if you don't have it yet. This is Intrinsic Anti-Barrier if you do not want to use sidearms. Some other good weapons to farm here would be the Aikilos SMG with Feeding Frenzy and Volt Shot, or you can go for the Retrofit Escapade with four times the charm and target lock. This is what I use whenever I'm capturing gays at the Golgi encounter. This will help you stay safe from the Minotaurs. You can just shred them really quick and easy. This is your Lost Sector rotation for this week. It comes with three recommended farms. If you need an exotic headpiece, make sure you go to Bunker E15. And if you need exotic legs, make sure you go to Skydock 4 or Concealed Void. The dungeon this week is going to be Shattered Throne. This is where you can get the exotic Bow Wish Ender that is really great for using in GMs. But you don't have to wait on the weekly rotation to do this. All you have to do is pick up the quest Hunter's Remembrance. Make sure you swing by the Discord. We'll get you somebody that can get that completed for you. The Nightfall this week is going to be Psyops Battlegrounds Cosmodrome. This Nightfall features Unstoppable and Barrier Champions as well as every shield in the game and an Arc Threat. There are also Arc Sniper Vandals on the tops of the roof, so you want to take this Arc Threat very seriously. Completing this on Grandmaster Difficulty will get you the Adept Slammer Sword. This sword skates further than the Half Truce and the other Half. And that's a fact. So if you want to farm for that, we're going to be doing that all week over on Twitch. The raid this week is going to be Vault of Glass. This is where you can get the exotic fusion rifle Vex Mythoclast. Apart from that, you can farm for weapons like your Fatebringer with Explosive Payload and Firefly. Or you can go for a Found Verdict with Auto Loading Holster and 1-2 Punch. But if you want one for PvP, this also rolls with Slide Shot and Opening Shot. That does it for this week's reset. If you enjoyed the video or found it informative, make sure you like, comment, share it with a friend. Follow and subscribe depending on which platform you're on. And we'll see you in the next one.